Trevin, 6-0 and in rank number 19. Are you kidding me? How are you feeling about this so far? I mean, we're super pumped. Uh, it just shows that all of our hard work in the summer and, you know, in the spring and even, you know, going through, like, our training camps throughout the year has really started to pay off. And, like, like I said before in, like, a couple interviews, like, this team is super special. And I'm really excited for, like, the whole Cougar fans, Cougar Nation, the whole world to see, like, how special this group of guys really are. So Arizona State, you guys were knocking down threes like crazy. And on this first one, Dallin Hall finds you in transition, and you're ready to go. So this play is, like, right before, like, second half just starts, like, a minute 30 in, and Dallin Hall gets the, the outlet, and I'm like, I'm just going to sprint the floor. Um, and before that, in the first half, like, I, I don't think I made a three. I think I was over or something, over two or something like that. And I remember Melvin Goins, our GA, comes up to me and goes, you need this much space. That's all you need mm. to get the ball off. And, like, that just gave me, like, a boost of confidence. So Dallin right here throws it up to me, a 70-foot pass, and I was able to just catch and shoot because of what Melvin said. And so just that much space really kind of helps me, like, get in that zone. And, you know, Dallin's an amazing point guard and is able to throw a 70-foot pass. Like, how many point guards out there can throw a, a pass right on target, right in my hands? I don't have to dip, don't even have to do anything. It's just perfect. So it was in the down. pocket, and I loved your footwork here. The the pitter patter to, to get in <laughs> into if position, you, right? If you ask some of the team, like I'll have floaters where I'll stutter a little bit, or even like shooting the ball, I'll stutter just to get my feet really right. Um, but some of the teammates will make fun of me a little bit. But you know, if it goes in, it goes in, right? A shooter knows his footwork. Yeah, a shooter knows you know his what footwork. I mean? Okay. <laughs> This is not the same play, but it looks like it. Noah Waterman is going to get the ball and then find you in transition as well. But you have a pump fake here, and I love a Tiki who <laughs> knows it's going in before anybody else. Yeah, let's watch, let's watch this one. We have Noah. Noah's playing the point guard. I was able to get the guy in the air. Quick stutter step and look at a Tiki. <laughs> <laughs> he knew, man. Uh, T, Tiki's awesome. He's a great teammate. Um, but even like in this game, Noah comes up to me out of a timeout and goes, hey, if one of us gets in the middle, look cross court, and we'll hit each other. Mm. And so literally, like, the play before I did it to him, and then the very next play, he does it to me. So, like, we have a really cool dynamic on the team. And, like, even look at Dallin. He's yelling at Noah for a great pass, and Noah's under the rim trying to rebound. Like, we, we do all the little things. I don't know why, things. but... I, I know, really, though. <laughs> <laughs> uh, but Noah does all the little things, and that's yeah. why he was MVP in the tournament. Yep. Okay, NC State, the next time. NC State. Ali Khalifa. We know we know he's an amazing passer. We're seeing it now. Yes. This is incredible. And credit to Ali. Like, he hasn't played in a game in a couple games now, and he comes in and plays almost 30 minutes. And, like, this is what makes him special. Watch this. Like, he can read it so well and then just throw a little quick little touch pass. And and he's he's running back with his hands up. And literally the very next play, watch, watch. Me and him make the biggest eye contact, and he's throwing it from the three-point line, and it's a laser right to the hands. Like... Credit to Ali, credit to the bench. Like, our bench is super special. Everybody's standing up. Everybody's really excited. So, like, that's what makes our team super dynamic. It's just not the guys on the floor. It's everybody in the, in the gym. We got Cougar fans standing up. Like, that's what makes it special. Is it best to hit a three in front of your own bench or the other, <laughs> or the other bench? Um, I like it in front of my bench because I feel like we, like, it's just super fun. Like, everybody on the bench is screaming at me and stuff like that. But every once in a while, it's fun to hit on the other side of the bench. Kind of like... Make sure like they know we're here and kind of quiet their little noise down there. So it's awesome. Okay, Fresno State in the Delta Center on uh, Friday to try and get to 7-0. Are you going to be tempted to shoot NBA threes since that line will be out there? <laughs> well, the fact that the line just keeps moving back, I feel like is is kind of helpful. But uh, we put the line in for practice just to make sure like we know where the college line is. Um, but at the end of the day, like a shooter knows where his feet are at, and everybody I trust everybody on the team to shoot exactly how they've been shooting. Um, and I just hope Cougar fans can bring the noise again. Like, we travel to Vegas. Let's travel a little bit up north and get the crowd rocking in the Delta Center. Let's go, baby. Okay, thanks for the time, Trevor. I Good luck, Jeremy.